All right, this is Lost for Words by Natalie Russell, and maybe the only book I know of that stars a tapir. All right, a tapir is this kind of pig-like beast from South America, and he's a star here. And the tapir is checking out everybody else's talents because he's got a notebook and a bit of a case of writer's block. Hippo writes exciting stories. Flamingo is a great song composer. And you can sing on the songs and read the poems. And then Taper can't figure out his talent. He ain't got nothing. He gets kind of down on himself. But he takes out his pencils and he starts drawing. And turns out that is actually his talent. <clears throat> he draws the trees. He draws his friends. And everybody digs it. And that's what he goes on with. So it's a really nice book. The art style is really cool. There is a connecting line through the story. Uh, that's you know got a nice meaning, which is keep trying, and you'll find your talent. Uh, everybody's got something, and it's it's just original because it's got a taper. And then I, you know, I do like this almost psychedelic art style. So check it out because Lost for Words is uh, is pretty nice.